hey guys so today i have with me another elf unboxing haul yay they were having a 50 percent off the entire site like everything and here is 50 percent off site wide i'm first gonna start with this because it's just laying on top here i was looking through videos, I was looking at other people's swatches and reviews, and I picked out some nail polishes, which I'm going to show you guys. Man, they make this hard to get into. Oh, I can't open it. Alright, so the first polish I got here is a really pretty coral. This one is in the shade Party Peach. I don't know if you can read that. Very, a solid, really bright coral shade, so... Um, this one is called Mango Madness. This one's really pretty as well. It's got a little bit of pink in it. So, really pretty color. And the next one is called Coral Dream. So it's a very softer color. I'll just hold all three of these up here. So you can see. Ah! And this one's the lightest shade which I'm surprised because on the website it looked more brighter. So the last one I wanted to get a pretty minty greenish bluish color and this one's really gorgeous. It's called Mint Cream. That's Mint Cream. Really gorgeous color. Moving on to the really big bag. I know, I went a little crazy cry cry. Alright, so first up I have some brushes and I love these one dollar brushes. I got two of the angled brushes. I love these. They're amazing. They're the angled blending ones. Look like that. So I got two of those and I got two of the blending eye brushes. They just look like that. Really fluffy. Alright, so next up I have another brush. and This is the small stippling brush. I love this one so much. A lip liner and blending brush duo. I love it. It's from the studio line. I love, love these lip liners. And already looking at this, it looks like a brown color. I got it in natural brown. And this is the color right here. So if you, if you get this, don't be too deceived. So it looks like a really nice nude. And you all know I love this studio um, makeup remover wipes. And I thought I would try these. These are the eye makeup remover pads from the Essential line. And they're about $2.00. And yeah, I'll be testing these out. This is one of the new items from e.l.f. And this is the new lip balm tint. And I got this one in the shade Peach. I only purchased one because I wasn't sure of how great I would like them. And besides, I have so many lip balms. And it looks like you get quite a bit of product. And the sticker's on the side. I'm going to see if I can put it on the bottom. This gives you a really nice, soft glossy color so it's not as bright in the pot as you think so here's just a swatch of peach this is the angled foundation brush and let's go ahead and pull it out I don't care let's pull it out hopefully this video won't be too long but who cares it's a haul it's supposed to be long oh this is nice I've seen a lot of people rave about this and it's the angled foundation brush so really pretty I love the angle on it it's sort of on the flat side so be nice for applying concealer maybe, like cream concealer. I really like this. I can't wait to try this out and just slap on the foundation. These are the Studio Lip Balm with SPF 15. Not to confuse you with the conditioning ones that come in the square jar. This is the one in the stick formula. And I just got this one in clear. Really great because it's clear. I do have other ones in different colors. This is new from the Studio line. It's the Eye Refresher. And this comes in a, ooh, it's a really shiny packaging. I'm gonna pull this out because I'm sure I'm just as curious as you guys. And I guess it's supposed to just refresh on your eyes. Comes in this really nice, I'm really impressed with the packaging on this. So this just comes out, ooh, it's very cooling. I don't know if you can see it or not, but it's just wet. Okay guys, so next up I have the Long Lasting Lustrous Eyeshadows. I am in love with these. I picked out three more and now I have all of them because I'm a greedy, greedy person. This one's in Celebration. Party. Looks like a dark bluish black color. 
And the last one is called Festivity. Oh my god. There's a whole lot left. <laughs> the Daily Brush Cleaner. I love this stuff so much. I went ahead and just thought, you know what? I better get another backup because I go through this stuff like crazy. So, Alright, so the next thing I have here is a blush. And I love the Elf Studio blushes. I have too many. But um, everyone always talks about Peachy Keen. So I went in and got Peachy Keen. So yeah, I mean, it's probably not showing up that well. You can kind of see it right there. Let's see if I can swatch it. Yeah, it has a lot more pigment than you think. This is a beautiful color. I wanted to try out the Studio Press Powder, and I've never tried this before, so this is new to me. This is fairly new, and I got it in porcelain, of course, the lightest shade. And let's go ahead and give this a look. Looky, looky. It comes in a really... Just to show you the difference, this is the blush, this is the powder. So, uh, I just love e.l.f. packaging. I don't know why, but so it comes, that's what it looks like. comes with a really nice mirror, and I like that it bends down. So there's a swatch. Holy mow. Wow, wow, wow. It's very, very pigmented, um, but the color is very yellow looking. So I don't know if I'll be able to use this or not. It's really, really hard for me to find a pressed powder that matches my skin tone so that's porcelain right there all right so I have another lip liner here again from the studio line and this one's in fuchsia like, I want a really bright pink lip liner and I don't own one so that is gorgeous that one matched perfect with my lipstick I'm wearing um dollhouse pink from wet n wild and yeah that would match perfectly I love it so this is another elf studio blush and this is in gotta glow and I've heard a lot of people say that this is a dupe for NARS, uh, I think it's called Arbitrage. Arbitrage? Arbitrage. Look at that, you guys. Oh my goodness. Let me see if I can. So that's got a glow. This is one of my favorite brushes from the studio line. It's the angled contour brush. I'm not going to get it out because I don't want this video to be too long, but it's just a nice angled fluffy brush. Great for blending out your crease color. Phenomenal. Love it. This one I'm so excited about. This is the one I haven't tried yet. This is called the Flawless Concealer Brush. And I've heard a lot of good things about this one too. That really fluffy, super dense, very, very dense. Wow, I'm really impressed. I wish I would have picked out more. And I got another package of the Shiny Racer Blotting Sheets. I love these. They're only like a dollar, so I think I got them for like 50 cents, I think. They're great for the summertime to blot your face if you get really, really oily, and I could use one right about now. This is another highlighting product, and this is a Radiance Enhancer in Spotlight. And it comes in like a tube, and I think there's a brush. Like I have a needle. Doctor. Eh. So that's Spotlight right there and can you tell it has that soft pinky tone to it so this will make a really gorgeous highlight also from the studio line this is the eyebrow treat and tame and it comes with like a clear serum and then a colored one I got the shade in medium and I oh I wasn't sure I mean their colors you know how it is but I just got one I thought I would try it mm. Every time I try to order this, it is always sold out, and I finally got my hands on it. This is the HD Blush in Headliner, which is the lightest shade. That's Headliner. Beautiful. I can definitely wear this one. All right, so next up here, I have an item that I did not order. <laughs> um, I did not order it, this. That's too funny. Well, thank you, Elf. I guess I get a free product. Um, this is the Contour Blush and Bronzing Powder Duo in Antiqua. I really love these colors. The bronzer is way too dark for me, but I do have this already and I really do love it. So I guess I have an extra one now. <laughs> this is the from the Essential Line. These are nail polish remover pads. And I've never really knew that they had these on the website. And I was like, what? Fresh citrus scent. So that'll be interesting. But it comes in like these little soaked cotton rounds. So I'm really interested in trying those out. So I did order two of the Studio Single Eyeshadows, but I am missing one. I looked everywhere. I'll have to contact them, but I'm like, oh, I'm so sad right now. Um, what I 
I ordered one in uh, Pebble. This is Pebble. And it's a really pretty taupe color. And the other one I ordered is called Mossy, Mossy Green. So they didn't give me Mossy Green. I guess they didn't want me to have any moss. I'm hoping this is a pretty taupe color. OMG, you guys. This is a beautiful matte, matte, <laughs> matte taupe. Look at that. Oh my god, I'm dying. I'm dying. Alright guys, the last two items here. These are the, I think it's, yeah, but from the studio line. These are the tone correcting powders and I've never tried these before and I've heard a lot of good things about them like everything else from e.l.f. So I got the one in warm and also in cool. It's really messy. Oh, please don't tell me it's shattered. Please, God, please, please, God. Oh, okay, it's not broken. <laughs> so it comes with a really huge mirror. I love these. Oh, I love the packaging on Elf. So this is the one in warm. I guess what you're supposed to do is swirl these all together and, you know, set your foundation. It's supposed to help counteract, you know, the coolness if you need some warmth. Just to hold these up side by side. This one's the warm and this one's the cool. Alright guys, that's it that completes my e.l.f. unboxing haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up. If you enjoyed, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe so you don't miss out on new videos. It's completely free. And you can come hang out and join the Smarter Beauty hangout area. I don't know what I'm doing with my hands. I will see you guys next time. Remember, Smarter Beauty is better beauty. Bye guys.